Absolutely. I was actually really excited about the mutual matching policy. I think it's very innovative and exciting. Um, in the same way, when you're hiring for any other job, you, you come in, you're interviewed. You know, the job that I work now, I had to meet the entire staff to make sure that my coming into the job site was not going to interrupt the culture of the school. The, my daughter's teacher, she has two, are the most important people that she comes in contact with ID, you know, on a daily basis. And the culture of her school is incredibly important to her learning. So I think it's absolutely crucial. Nobody knows the school site better, right, than the principal, the teachers there, and the parents and the students. And so absolutely they should have say so on who's coming to campus. And the same thing for the teacher, right? How horrible is it that you get to a job? I don't know. It's happened to me. I take the job. It sounds all great on the outside. I didn't do my due diligence, and then I'm there. and stuck for at least two years, so I didn't look bad on my resume. <laughs> uh, follow-up question for you okay. on that. Mutual matching was proposed this last spring and it met a lot of opposition and ultimately wasn't implemented. As a board member in that role, how would you work to change the course of that policy, like you know, of that of those negotiations and policy implementation so that we can move this forward? Aside from being, I mean, being a consistent, continuous advocate and building a coalition, I'm really big on coalition building and organizing. I think it said in my questionnaire that I'm an organizer, and part of being an organizer is being able to bring people from different ideologies to the table um, to, to discuss and work through them to, to get what's best. Trying to identify the what's in it for me factor, so the second half of my question was like not, or my answer was not only just what's best for the schools, but how do you reframe this debate so that teachers start to understand and the union can start to understand this is also what's best for teachers. That stabilizes the workforce and ensures them to have a better experience and allows them to do their job more effectively because everybody's sure that they've ended up in the absolute right place.